the American equivalent of the uh, Tiger Moth. And though with the steam, and as you might imagine with Americans, you get a lot more bang for your bucks. It's a big machine. Well, it's a warm welcome to Sue Gerdler, who is flying the Stearman today. And I'm very proud to have known Sue and her family from way back in the 1980s. I was privileged to work for her father-in-law, former Red Arrows pilot, Ted Gerdler, who uh, had a very successful flying school. It was part of the Air Cadet Flying Scholarship Scheme I was privileged to instruct with them for over five years and two and a half thousand hours of flying. And Sue was the administrator and manager of the school. She got her pilot's license. And here she is today. I'm very proud to give a commentary on her display. developed in the 1930s by the Boeing Aircraft Company. Yes, that's the same Boeing company that built the 747. It's got the classic look and line of an old-fashioned biplane. And if you listen to that engine, that classic sound of a biplane in flight. I have also to confess to another family connection. My father was a pilot under the Arnold scheme in 1941, when under Lend Lease pilots were trained by the American and Canadian Air Force. And the Stearman very much came into its own as a training aeroplane for fledgling RAF and Canadian Air Force and American Air Force pilots, many of whom went on to see active service in the Second World War on various types from fighters to bombers to Coastal Command, which is the command my father proudly served in until 1947. So we're enjoying the lovely vintage lines of the Boeing Stearman. That lovely open radial engine. They ended up in America mainly as crop dusting aircraft with the front seat, with a tank put on the front seat. Crop dusting, thanks to modern technology, is something that we see very little of these days. Keeping these machines rolling is really an endless task, isn't it? And it needs people who really have skills. And dedication. One of the problems, Ken, is getting spare parts, of course, for these old vintage aeroplanes. There's a lovely sight. Get those cameras ready. These aircraft are maintained to the highest standards by licensed and qualified aeroplane engineers. She can see you, folks. Give her a wave. the speed back. Very nice. Let's give her a wave. Come on, she can see the crowd line. Show your thanks and appreciation to that lovely, as I say, elegant display of flying from Flying Granny of Sue Girdler. Jim, let's show our appreciation applause for Sue Girdler and the Boeing Stearman. Give it up, give it up, that's it, thank you. Well done, Sue. Well, there we are, Sue will wind her way back to Prestwick Airport.